You've, you've heard of acupuncture where they push needles in you. Have you ever heard of acupressure? Now, you have to watch very close. Some people think there are pressure appointments, treatment for disease. I don't believe anything like it, but let me show you what I've discovered. This is very amazing. Look, if I press right here for three seconds, that's the perfect treatment for anemia. Now, anemia lack iron, right? This is far, far better because you get solid steel. Oh, God. Would you take the aces, please? Put them all together, face down in the center. Now, many, many years ago, I discovered that I could just simply wave my hand over the deck like this, and those four aces would physically come to the top. Do you want to deal the four top cards face up on my hand? <laughs> now that looked good, but come to think about it, I could have had four other aces on the deck already. I didn't, but I could have had. So why don't you put your initials? All four aces have been initialed. I didn't pay any particular attention to top aces, ace of clubs. Would you take the cards and could you follow my instructions exactly? Please turn the top ace face down on the deck. Deal the four aces face down in a pile here. Next four cards face down in a pile there and then you hold on to the deck. Now, if I never cover these cards and get these cards near these cards, there is no way known to man I can switch them. It is impossible. Let me show you what I mean. Just put these on the bottom, if you would. Would you deal the next four cards face down in a pile, please? Now, I want you to watch every move I make. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I think everyone can agree, I have never gotten these cars near these cars. She initialed those aces before we started. That's why it seems absolutely impossible, but she can verify the fact that over here, with her initials, are the aces. Thank you very much. And over here are the indifferent cards. Now these are your four aces. There is no question about that. I'm going to sort of squeeze them like that down to infinity. And they will be absolutely gone and I, they've gone into my pocket and here are your <laughs> one, two, three, four aces. Thank you. You take out any card you'd like and show it to them but don't let me see it. Put your initials on the face of it, please. Okay. Now put your card back in the deck any place you'd like. There we go. Now if I push that card in and shuffle the deck even once, you'd have no idea where your card was even supposed to be. There's her card. I have no idea what it is. It's down there about two-thirds of the way from the top. Now I'm not going to shuffle those cards. I'm going to ask you to think of any real small, small number. Make it between one and five. Otherwise, it'll take too long and tell us the number you're thinking of. Uh, four. You're thinking of four. Okay, you take the cards. Have you ever heard of telekinesis? No. That's mental control of physical objects. Now, I don't believe anything like that, but let's pretend you have the power. I want you to mentally move the card that you put in the deck yourself, that you initialed from where I, you put it to number four. Okay. Now, deal four cards. One, if you deal four cards one at a time on my hand and the fourth card is yours, you get all the credit. Okay. One, two, three, four. Bravo. Four cards are here. Thank you. I'm going to deal any card that you think of to any number that she thinks of mm. without you telling me the card or she telling me the number. Now, that doesn't sound possible, does it? <laughs> Okay, you take out any card you'd like. Put your initials on the face of it. Now put your card well down in the deck, and you'll understand why. Maybe a little bit lower. There we go. Here's her card, I have no idea what it is down there, I'd say 45 cards from the top. 
If I give you a choice of any number between 1 and 52, and you pick a number anywhere near 45, that is no good because that's where a card is right now, right? Would you consider it fair if I give you the choice of any number between, let's say, 10 and 30? Sure. Okay, think of any number between 10 and 30. Do not tell me. I'm going to count, and you stop me when I come to your number. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, Stop. 15, Stop. 14, Stop. at 14. Mm-hmm. Now you had a free choice. You could have stopped it at 15. You could have stopped me at 16. What was the name of your card with your initial? Do you recall? Eight of spades. Eight of spades with your initial. <gasps> oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Thank you.